53-year-old Gregory Travis Gowan was sentenced to 25 years in federal prison in a meth trafficking case. The announcement was made on Thursday by U.S. Attorney for the Western District of North Carolina, Dina J. King. It was also announced that Gowan will serve five years under court supervision following his release from prison. Burke County Sheriff Banks Hintzman joined U.S. Attorney King in making that announcement on Thursday. According to Thursday's sentencing hearing and documents filed with the court, in February of 2022, law enforcement investigating the defendant's drug trafficking activities executed search warrants at his residence and vehicle in Burke County. Law enforcement seized more than $100,000 from the defendant's residence and vehicle as well as a quantity of methamphetamine and items consistent with drug distribution. Subsequently, law enforcement executed additional search warrants at the defendant's garage and residence and more drugs and cash were seized over the course of the investigation. Law enforcement determined that the defendant was responsible for trafficking more than 60 kilograms of meth in Burke County and was a major source of supply for local dealers. On August 21st of 2023, the defendant pleaded guilty to conspiracy to possess with intent to distribute methamphetamine and two counts of possession with intent to distribute methamphetamine. The defendant is currently in federal custody and was to be transferred to the custody of the Federal Bureau of Prisons upon designation of a federal facility. In making the announcement, U.S. Attorney King thanked the DEA and Burke County Sheriff's Office for their assistance in the investigation. So once again, a 25-year prison sentence for Gregory Travis Gowan of Morganton. Reporting for WHKY News, I'm Rob Eastwood.